We're Field.io, um, we're a, a studio working in digital art and generative design. We've been working together for almost 10 years now. We've got a studio here in, in the print house. In the beginning, kind of Field was kind of founded on this core idea that we looked at what can digital art to design. And it kind of could do three things. It can make things interactive, generate a lot of complexity, and you can create behavior or make things alive. We started out with a, a very clear focus on generative design, on building tools for design, and doing interactive installations and making interactive in experiences. So what we try and do is to really focus on one uh, emotion or one feeling that we want people to have when they experience the work. I think we're not mainly motivated by politics, but it certainly plays a role. It probably influences the way how we pick our projects more than uh, at the moment we're working for an energy research centre. All the artworks there are about the spirit of discovery, renewable energies, etc. That's probably more the political directions you take, working for certain companies and certain companies not. We often get approached to visualize data. People, they don't really want to visualize the, the facts necessarily. For that you have analytics tools, but they rather want to use data to illustrate a point. Uh, we've been contacted by the uh, curatorial team of the Barbican. They came across our piece Energy Flow. It really felt at that time like uh, there were so many really upsetting things happening in the world from the Arab Spring, um, Fukushima, climate change, um, big, big storms. Things are always in flux, they are always in change and, and, and uh, transformation. On a small and on a large scale, things are always in, in motion. That kind of became the idea for the structure of the project. We um, produced 10 animated short films that are completely unrelated, um, but that, that share a similar um, approach in being about unstable systems. And then we created an algorithm that generates 1,000 unique narratives out of these, um, these 10 films. When you um, watch the experience, um, you, you get presented with a new narrative every time you play it, but you might um, recognize things from a previous iteration and that was really what we what we wanted to do to have this kind of very stimulating experience of seeing things happen in different contexts. The Barbican show I mean it's, it's good that it's here but these shows they are conceived years in advance they look back in a couple of years digital art won't be a term anymore because it's already exploded into 30 40 I can't count it different subcategories I think um, technology or new media, um, in whatever form they came about, have always been fascinating for artists. Just make something interesting with it, so that people might be fascinated by it and, and want to look a step deeper. It's all about telling stories and it's about always a bit about magic as well.